Well, good day to you on a grey day here, which uh, promises rain, but promises way beyond that what should be a really good game of football. The stands are packed here, people have done everything they can to get here. Indeed, the roads outside were pretty badly clogged, but I think most of the traffic issues have been settled, and indeed, I think most people have now got through the turnstiles and are well covered up against the elements, whatever they may throw at us over the next hour or two. So what a stage for the players to take to here ahead of such an important game. Well, if you did just miss it, we are up and running already. Jim, which player is best equipped for this game? Yeah, Harry Kane. He's a deadly finisher, Peter, obviously, but he can contribute much more than that for his team. He's got the physical presence to hold the ball up and the awareness to bring pretty much everyone else into play. His best attributes, however, might be his, his enthusiasm, his energy and his desire to win because those things become infectious to others. Yes, he's certainly the one who carries the hopes of his team. It's a very good battle there, terrific to watch. Sanchez. Tottenham have pushed both fullbacks into quite advanced positions here. Yeah, that's that's interesting. So what are they attempting to do? Well, it's it's a bold attempt, in my opinion, to occupy the opposition in a way they're not expecting. Daniel Alves. been a rather gentle affair so far. Oh, good interception. That is asked, real chance! He scored! Gatsaniga reacted well to the initial effort, but couldn't get it right out of the danger area. Oh, look, there's only one player who merits all the praise for that. Not only did he finish it, but his instincts for being where he was are absolutely top-notch. Deadlock broken, it's 1-0. Yeah, and they know there's plenty of work left in this one, Peter, before they can actually say that the job is over. Hardly anything between the sides, and it's 1-0. Tottenham have come to the defence of their manager after he came in for some stick regarding some of his decision-making. I think tactically he didn't make a good job of things for starters and then compounded matters in trying to correct it. I only hope he sticks in. Deli Ali gets into a dangerous position. Daniel Alves. De Ligt. Ronaldinho. Out to the left it goes. to get it forward quickly. Oh, what a... It's one! It's anyone's ball. Cleared without complication. Forward. What does he try from here? There were better options before the ball was lost. Easy to save from up here, I know. Yeah. 
And the weighted pass. And for a moment, you felt that was going somewhere, but they'll have to go again. Good challenge, excellent challenge. Kane has alert to the possibilities, but in the end, it's fruitless. Now the counter. He's there to receive it. He's had a goal! Wanted to outwit the keeper, but a shade off target. Well, it could have been and probably should have been a, a different choice of finish. There was lower space to hit. Has a hit! Oh, that was extravagant by any standard. Oh, that's fantastic improvisation he showed there. Adjusted himself very quickly, but it's rare that they come off. It's a free kick. Well, Let's be lenient here. I doubt he'll get too many more chances. Now it's Kane. Aurier. And it's played forward. No messing about, just bludgeoned away. Hoists it forward. Kane. Oh, great defending, that needed doing. Forward it goes. And they've reached half time. And there we are. Off they go for half time. The breakthrough did indeed come in the first half. But there has only been that one goal. It is very, very tight. I'm sure they'll be very happy with the first half performance and the scoreline. They'll definitely want to maintain their momentum now and finish the job. Needing 1 0 at the break. You're just back from your break, you've missed very little of the resumption of the second half. A Kane! He's done very well to get to that. Well, that was high-class goalkeeping there to back up his, his high-class wage. Plays it out to the flank. And he's going long. A really good feat from him. That intervention was very necessary. Gets the better of his man. Played into the middle. And they've been caught. He's had a shot. Well, that looks a foul. Yep, referee's given it. He knew what was coming, that's a yellow card. Well, this certainly fits the bill when it comes to the man for the occasion. He certainly looks appetising, well within shooting range. Going for goal! Oh, that's fabulous! Oh, it really is a finish of the highest order. Two up now, and they are cruising. And he's produced a beauty. So that's two now without reply.
that second goal is such a, a polarizing effect on prospective moods. I mean, one team are under more pressure now to get the next goal, and the other will fancy their chances of turning two into three. Ali. Dele Ali! Oh, what a wonderful stop! The keeper really dug out his defense then. A magnificent effort. Away from immediate danger. Tottenham have turned to their bench, and we're going to have a substitution. Marco Verratti. Marco Verratti doesn't get the pass he's looking for. Son Hyung Min. De Ligt, of whom the stats say he is the best player in the team in the air. Good challenge, he just stood firm. Well, it seems obvious that the plan is to, to try and get their passing game going again, but not with that lack of quality. And it's Kane. Ali. It's a throw in. Time for a change in personnel. And out it comes again. Ali really got caught in a trap there, and he just couldn't get out. It's a great gallop down the right-hand side. Pumps it into the area. A hefty challenge, but fair enough. And that has been clear. Tottenham can make their change now with uh, a break in play. Well, he's worked so hard for his side, uh, as you would expect, but he couldn't help notice that he was starting to, to labour a bit, so it's no surprise. Battles to win it back. Coming on the right now. What's on? He's got away. And they've got it back as soon as they gave it away. Sanchez. Leading by two and the finishing line in sight. Aurier looking to run onto it. To lift. Attempt to clearance. Down by a lack of accuracy. Gets away from his opponents. Well, the defence got the better of him this time, but I'm sure he'll go again. Uh, needed a better pass there. Daniel Alves. De Ligt. Tries to switch the play. He's got through. And that has been clubbed away. He's gone for a throw in. Nice clear cut. That's a free kick. And he is going into that little black book.
Lo Celso. Dele Alli. Well played, he saw that coming. He's found his man. This is promising. Hits one! Taken with style! Deep, deep into injury time! Well, you've got to say, the odds on him missing from there were very soon. It's really a problem when that much time is afforded the penalty box. Nobody sensed where the danger was lurking, and the finish was made a lot easier. Tottenham. And in time is up. And there goes the whistle. Well, whatever the shortcomings on either side, it was a great game to watch. Just one between them. So, Jim, how do you reflect on what we've seen? Look, you often need resolve and resilience when under more pressure away from home, but I thought their efforts deserved that. I think we're just about out of time, so many thanks to Jim and a very good afternoon. So, perfect blue skies, almost no wind, beautiful sunshine. These are indeed conditions for the beautiful game. The backdrop here, picturesque, idyllic. No doubt one of the best days of the footballing calendar, and it has added to a really jovial, happy mood in the stands, helping to raise the level of sound by more than a few decibels. Shirt sleeve order, very much the dress code. This is gone, that's a foul. Taking him long, and that's going to be a booking. Well, the protest continues, but in the end, they are defending the indefensible. What a start. Free kick in a dangerous position in the opening minutes. So who is the target now? He's having a look at what's available. Up to meet it! And the ball's come loose! Oh, real danger here! He's there to receive it. Has a hit! Well, if that was their intention pre-match, let me tell you, it's worked out very nicely. I think for the skipper to chip in with a goal, too, is a bonus. But this game has already taken on a real attacking edge, and long may that continue. The keeper deserves some sympathy there. He may not have seen that until too late. Deadlock broken, it's 1-0. Still a fragile lead, though. They can't afford to sit on this. Chelsea are oh, the league's top scorers. Formidable in front of goal. Forward it goes. With a delicate ball. Done very well to intervene. Oh, terrible pass. Chelsea have been mighty impressive away from home, unbeaten in five. Dani Alves. Loses his balance and loses the ball. Big chance! And he's 
there to make a great save. Oh, that's a sparkling save. Absolutely sparkling. His reflexes were ultra sharp. Werner really was well marshalled there because he was denied the opportunity to, to turn. Werner. Chelsea have pushed both fullbacks into quite advanced positions here. Yeah, that's that's interesting. So what are they attempting to do? Well, it's it's a bold attempt, in my opinion, to occupy the opposition in a way they're not expecting. Gets it back. And back to base. Christensen has been included in the starting 11 for the first time in some weeks. There has been just the early goal here, and the score is 1 0. needed to be better than that and he knows it Danny Alves is charging up on the overlap cleared away to lift it back no messing about just bludgeoned away Aimed in towards the centre. Conte. Zayak. Dealt with that well. Can't get the better of his opposite number. Savage. Danger averted for now. And it's Chilwell. Pulisic. Hit into the middle. That's been levered clear. Tries to stroke it through. He's good for it! And that has been clubbed away. Could move up a gear here. Rudiger. Pulisic. Looks to clip it forward. Buffon catches it safely. Hoists it forward. And the weighted pass. Chance to squeeze it through. No, not quite. Daniel Alves. He's got through. And the half time whistle goes. So there you have it, a close sport half of football that still had its moments and ultimately produced just one goal. I'm sure they'll be very happy with the first half performance and the scoreline. They'll definitely want to maintain the momentum now and finish the job. Leading 1-0 at the break. So we're just settling back into this second half. Well, 1-0 may be good enough, so they may err on the side of caution and, and get more players behind the ball instead of running beyond it. They could even try to, to spoil it from here, we'll see. Uh, needed a better pass there. 
A real chance to break. Chilwell. Conte. Lampard. Played out to the right. Lovely bit of skill there. There are a few waiting for it. Chelsea coming into this game on the back of a really good result. And their boss must take an awful lot of credit for that. Well, Peter, he was lauded by the media, and quite rightly too. I think what he did was clever and decisive, and it just goes to show how tactically astute he is. Kante did well to emerge with the ball. That's a contest to keep an eye on. A buccaneering run from the defender. Still just a single goal between the sides. Werner. Oh, the ball's come loose and the chase is on. To the right, Danny Alves. A really good feat from him. Chance to shoot! Oh, just lacked a decent finish. Questions were asked, but he's given the answers. De Ligt. De Ligt sends it forward. It's gone out for a throw-in. So now we're going to get those changes we have been expecting. The licks. So, Jim, what are you thinking? Well, while the temptation's always there, Peter, I think it would be ill-advised of them to try settle for what they've got. It's been intercepted, and that will come to nothing. Christensen, and it's played forward. And again, they run up against stubborn defending. Chelsea showing a little more urgency now, and to be honest, Peter, this is what's required. Well, this isn't the time to talk about risks now, Jim, is it? They just have to hurl everything at it and hope for a break. Well, there's no two ways about it. This is what they have to do. And it's Adama Traore. That intervention was very necessary. This is good ball retention, and it should be enough from here, but they want to double their advantage. And the shot! Oh, that should have been two. He got too ahead of himself there, thinking how he could have made things safe. That could spell trouble. Going for goal! They've scored! Do not write them off! Back they come! An act of charity gratefully received.
Chelsea have turned to their bench and we're going to have a substitution. Well, you have to feel a little for the player being taken off here. I think he's been made the scapegoat after that, but I guess something had to be done. I suppose it did need a little change. That has certainly made things interesting. Well, the big question now is whether they can keep the energy levels up and try and grab a winner. Gets on the end of it. Real chance! That's a real chance missed. You get the feeling that whoever scores the next goal here will be the winners of this time. They can't afford to waste chances like that, though. Cleared away. Daniel Alves. A couple of changes then in quick succession. Well, he's worked so hard for his side, uh, as you would expect, but he couldn't help notice that he was starting to, to labour a bit, so it's no surprise. He's in space and looking for options. Up he gets! Oh, nearly, but nearly is nothing. Werner did give it a fair old crack, and he'll be encouraged to step up again. Daniel Alves. There's only one word for this, it, it's baffling. That team needs to figure out where the ball needs to be, and it's not well there. Well waited. Beautifully done. Well, that's surely a foul free kick. Well, they're struggling to cope with a, a pacey dribble because they've not been at it as a team. I think the collective pressure needs to be better all around. Very little time to go, and they have a free kick in a really promising area. So, who's he going to be aiming for here? Plays it back. Hits one! Good effort, he got plenty on that. Yeah, the shot was enabled, Peter, due to such smart control and technique. It's a decent ball. Buffon can pick that up. And that is it, the referee has seen it up. Passion and panache and perseverance, and in the end, parity. A really good game to watch. What are your thoughts on today's game then, Jim? Yeah, this looked the most likely outcome, but we've had a, a good variety in this game, despite it being anticlimactic. That's it from us. Many thanks go to Jim Beglin, and goodbye from us.
So welcome one and all to our live coverage of the ongoing group stage here, the tournament making steady progress towards its knockout phase. We'll be ready to go once the final checks are carried out. We have a hugely expectant crowd here. We just hope that the game lives up to the atmosphere. Well, this really is a great venue. It adds so much character to every game it stages. Has a pop! And he's there to make a great save. Oh, that's a sparkling save. Absolutely sparkling. His reflexes were ultra sharp. They've played it short. And he's there to clear it. That's great strength on the ball. Adama Traore. And that has been cleared. Lovely bit of skill there. There's the ball in. That right side seems to have become a very good outlet for them now. No doubt this is an area they've identified as a potential weakness in their opposition. And they're and they certainly caught him there. It's a free kick. Produced a beauty. Deadlock broken, it's 1 0. And that ought to be the trigger for a really exciting and entertaining game from here on. Let's put a stop to that. Plays it out to the flank. Drilled in low. Tries to get it forward quickly. Ronaldinho. Chance! Good first touch and almost as good a second. Oh, that's a great effort. There was very little backlift to indicate what was coming. Shapes to shoot! Hardly anything between the sides, and it's 1-0. He's having a look round. He could be... Tries a shot! Sticks it away! They are right back in business. Now looking back at that, that's how you play on the counter. Quick and decisive and ruthless with the finish. I thought it was a stunning, stunning breakaway. Norseland grab the equaliser and we're all square. It's pulsating, it's absorbing and it's hugely entertaining. Every single player is giving everything. Questions were asked and he's given the answers. It's a great ball. Back in and the shot! A real chance and a real let-off. Forward it goes. Gets it back. It a move that looked promising, but uh, eventually thwarted without doing any harm. Gets wrestled off the ball. Hoists it forward. And it's Adama Traore. Some good work on the right flank. Now, what's next? And it's half-time here. 
what it has been an even contest as the scoreline suggests and it has been more than decent to watch they come for the break with nothing to separate them the score 1-1 there's the whistle then to start the second half that's a good ball real chance Caused the worry or two. Uh, that's a little unfortunate. He had a lot of people worried then. Ronaldinho. Ronaldinho. There are a few waiting for it. Shakes the volley. It's their yeah, effort. He reacted well. I have to commend the wing plate, but I have to condemn the defending. They've got to stop the cross. Oh, that is lovely footwork. Kings it out wide. Tries to strip it through. And it's played forward. It's all a little short of forward momentum, lacking thrust. Plays it out to the wing. Defence got the better of him this time, but I'm sure he'll go again. That'll be a throw. Well, there is some activity down on the touchline. It seems there's going to be a change. Great strength, too strong for his opponent. Battles to win it back. Norschland going about it patiently, perhaps too patiently. Cuts it out. Ronaldinho. There were better options before the ball was lost. Easy to save from up here, I know. Ball's out on the left, now. Looking for a decent ball in. Good challenge, he just stood firm. Norgeland showing a good level of intensity at this stage. They're calling on all their resources now. The final five minutes. Knocks it away. Oh, that's neat. Adama Traore. And it's been taken straight back. Brahimi. And that's it. So nothing between them after all of that. And you can't really argue with the result. Oh, the manager too unhappy with the outcome. And the fans really well entertained. It's all square in the end. So what do you take away from it all, Jim?